We're living in historic times. We need a historic magazine to make sense of them. This is Radio Atlantic. I'm Matt Thompson, deputy editor of The Atlantic. I'm Jeffrey Goldberg, the editor-in-chief of The Atlantic. Alex Wagner, I'm a contributing editor at The Atlantic. Every week, the three of us will bring you conversations about what's happening in our world. And just as important, we'll talk about how things became the way they are and where they're going next. The Atlantic was created on the eve of the Civil War about 160 years ago, and we've been publishing ever since. In that time, we brought you some of the leading voices of every generation And now, we'll have those voices in conversation with me, Jeff, and Alex every week on Radio Atlantic. Our first episode about the past, present, and future of the American idea comes out this Friday, July 21st. Jeff, Alex, and I will be joined by Atlantic journalists David Frum and Molly Ball. Here's a preview of what you'll hear when you tune in. I don't know that the Republican Party, as it existed before 2016, can emerge again. After this, too many people are too deeply committed to what Donald Trump has been doing. I don't think America elected Donald Trump because they didn't realize that he doesn't always tell the truth. They knew that and they wanted to elect him anyway. One of the questions I I worry about a lot is to what extent is the president of the United States now in the chain of command? Are the military acting independent of his orders? Although I personally and I suspect many people would be vastly cheered if James Mattis, we're president of the United States right now, rather than Donald Trump. He's not. We'll also hear from John Batiste, the legendary jazz musician and the band leader for The Late Show with Stephen Colbert, who will talk about his interpretation of our theme song, The Battle Hymn of the Republic, which you're listening to right now. So don't miss it. Subscribe to Radio Atlantic wherever you get your podcasts. We'll see you this Friday. <laughs>